Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel, Etta here. I got uh, two boxes yesterday from UPS for my Sensi order. Um, they came together, they were supposed to come one day apart, but one is a very small order and the other one was the close of a party. So it was not a very big party, but um, I went ahead and closed it. Um, so I wanted to go through that and I'm kind of anxious to see the smaller order, which I think the biggest item in there was the um, Sebastian Buddy that's a friend of mine wanted to order. I think it was that was the biggest thing in that box, but the poor box, my son tried to fix the box. I mean, it was like all mangled. He's like, I hope there's nothing breakable in there. And I was like, oh my gosh. But he was trying to fix the box himself. So I don't want to cut too deep just because I don't know what's going to be right there. Luckily, it's paper. And I'll throw the paper on the floor, which means I'm going to have some cleanup to do later. Okay. I tried to grab it as one big thing, but it seemed like it was maybe, yeah, it seems to be like wrapped around some stuff. So I'm going to try to cut this paper right here. Oh boy. Okay, so luckily where it was kind of smashed was not even by the buddy, which I'm glad because it's not mine and so I don't want it to get messed up. So I'm not going to pull it out of the box because again, it's not mine. But here is the box for Sebastian. Really, really cute. I could probably just kind of open it and peek at it if I can open it carefully and not mess up the box. I don't want to pull it out because I probably could never get it back in the way it was in there. Oh, he is adorable. Okay. Let's see. You can't really see him that good. Um, he's kind of really pushed in there. I would love to pull him out, but like I said, he's he's not mine, and I don't feel I don't feel good about opening somebody else's products. So I'm just gonna leave that there. And of course, with that um, buddy came the scent pack. So here's her scent pack for her buddy, and then um, almost. Almost the rest of this isn't even mine. Uh, it was more gifts that I was trying to pick up. So um, some of it is mine. My husband took my only car bar clip of coconut lemongrass to, to use in his vehicle. So I went ahead and purchased a replacement for that because I like the way that smells. And then since these were on special because they are part of the scent of the month for April, I went ahead and got three um, scent circles in Plumeria Peach. So here are the other two. So three of those. And since they were still available and you still can't bundle and save them, I went ahead and picked up one more pod of the Marvel Nine Realms because I do like that scent and I wanted to have an extra one. And then the other thing in here is a gift for someone. I went ahead and picked up as a gift. I thought it would make a, a good gift for someone. I got a bag of pink cotton Scentsy Soak and the pink cotton body wash. So that was that order. And if you notice from the items that I showed you, I did not pick up any wax in that order. So I'm kinda happy about that. Oh, I should have kept the box so that I could put stuff back in. Oh, try to get this back in there, pull the rest of that paper out. Person's gift. Try to get that buddy in there because I don't want anything to happen to it before I can get it to the person that it belongs to. Throw this back in, ah. and this back in. All right. And then the other box was the um, 
box from a party order, so it's a little bit bigger. It's kind of heavy. I can't remember. I can't remember what I got that would make it so heavy. Um, oh, I do remember what one of my half price items was, and that probably added a bit of weight to this. Like I said, it wasn't a very big party order, so we'll see. Uh, making sure this is mine. Looks like it. Yep, it's mine. And nothing is on back order, thank goodness. More paper. More paper. I did pick up something from the uh, consultant store. I had had my eye on it for a couple of weeks because I think it came out a couple of weeks ago. And so I really wanted it. My goodness, they did a nice job of packing it and it is heavy. I think that definitely added to the weight. Oh my goodness. I picked up one of the doormats and I picked up the one that says, fill your life with fragrance. And then it says Scentsy. Let's see. I don't know how well you could see it through the plastic. Oh my goodness. Let's see if I'll put it way back here by me. Try to bring it up a little closer so maybe you could see it. I'm not sure how much of it you could see. But really nice. Big. Oh my goodness. Big. Let me stand up. That is nice. I really like that. All right, that's gonna go at my front door. And um, let's see if I can see the inside. If I can open it. I wanted to see if, um, okay. I wanted to see if that middle section, the Sensi part, if it seemed like it was removable or not, but it does not seem removable. The back of it is just one flat um, black portion. That is, that's really nice for, I think they were $18. Really, really nice. Um, and there's a box. I don't want to mess this up. Let me put this back here for a second. Because I don't want I don't want it to fall off the table and break. Oh my goodness. Yeah. This box is where the the real weight was. And then that mat was quite heavy. All right. This little box. More paper. Oh my gosh. Good thing I have one of those big green trash bags going right now that I can use. All right. Oh, <laughs> I guess I for I guess I forgot that I had ordered one more of the um Marvel 9 Realms in the small order that I did because I picked up another one. So, I got another pack of the pods for Marvel 9 Realms. I'm going to throw it into the other box. It's not that big. And I picked up one more of the sugared strawberry because um, I have normally I use the little mini uh, fan diffuser at my desk when I'm working, but this week I've been using my Sensi Go. And because you really can't do two pods in the mini diffuser, but you can with the Sensi Go. And I really wanted to do a combination. I did one pod of sugared strawberry with one pod of squeeze the day. And it smells so good at my desk. I like, I have the, the one, the rose gold one. So it's it one of those where it turns off after three hours. So as soon as it turns off, I turn it right back on and cycle through it again and gosh it just smells so good and I think I had only picked up one originally when they came out so I said you know what it's not part of the normal pods that's available so I said let me go ahead and pick up another one before they happen to sell out so I did that and then for one of my half price items I decided to go with um a bundle of the laundry liquids and 
I thought that would be a good idea because I think I've mentioned before on my Scentsy Club, I generally do the washer with tubs. I do that as my half price item. And um, again, I have a every two months, I have an every three months. And then under my husband's name, I have an every two months. Um, So like I'll be getting my bi-monthly and his bi-monthly in May. We didn't get anything in April. Um, and for one of, on the one for mine, I think I did the, um, the whiff box. And then on his, I did a tub of the washer whiffs. So I tend to accumulate some of the washer whiffs, although we go through it. Um, but I do the washer whiffs, but I don't have the, the laundry detergent. Um, which is not as big a deal to me because I do enjoy just using regular, I mean, I'll just use regular laundry detergent for me. It's the scent from the washer whips is what I'm really looking for. But I do like the, the laundry liquid that we have. I think it works really well. So since I had a half price item that I could do, I said, let me do a three pack bundle and I'll get it in scents that I would normally get for my washer whips. So this is one, this is actually the washer whiffs that's coming in his is going to be jammy time. So I picked up a laundry liquid of jammy time. And I picked one up in Scentsy Clean because I um, I think the last party I did a half price laundry love and I picked up the entire thing of Scentsy Clean. So I figured I'm probably going to be picking up more Scentsy Clean washer whiffs in um club orders so i figured i might as well get an extra one of that for the next time i pick up the scentsy clean and i got one of clothesline because those seem to be the ones that i generally like the most i think um i'm enjoying the palm beach breeze one but it doesn't quite leave the scent that i'm looking for on it so so far of the ones that are available Clothesline, Jammy Time, and Scentsy Clean are probably the ones that I like the most. But by far, my two favorites have been Ocean, which is no longer available, and Sunkiss Citrus, when that was in the laundry. Oh my gosh, I loved that one so much. It, from my towels, loved it, loved it, loved it, loved it. So anyways, those are the laundry liquids that I picked up. And then um, just using some of my reward money or whatever, I picked up a shower gel in jammy time. I'm like coming way close to you. Sorry about that. Jammy time. (coughs) Excuse me. (coughs) Wow, like air went down the wrong way. I don't know and a shower gel <clears throat> sorry let me breathe for a second and a shower gel in candy crave so i have been dying to try this one and because i love the wax <clears throat> absolutely love the wax so i thought you know what i'm finally going to get around to trying the shower gels i really had no business buying any shower gel because before I, you know, started buying Scentsy, even when I started buying Scentsy, I really just did wax. And so I have a gazillion shower gels and stuff from different places that I've bought them from. Um, so I, I didn't actually need any shower gel, but I thought, you know what, I'm, I, I'm, uh, I think I'm like halfway through with the one that I'm using of a different, you know, brand. I said, but when I finish that one, I'm going to go ahead and try one of the Scentsy ones and get an opinion of my, for myself of, as to what I think about them. So um, I did pick up a bottle of oil, yes, <clears throat> of Lotso Lemon. For some reason, I thought I had picked up a replacement bottle when um, when we were changing catalog seasons but I didn't. I, I went through my um, orders to look for it and I realized, no, I did not pick it up. And my jar of lots of lemon is not going to make it through the summer. So I was like, you know what, right now, while I have some party money to use, I'm going to pick up a bottle of lots of lemon. Love that scent. 
then let's see I think I got um, oh okay I was like what did I do all right I picked up a three pack of licensed scent circles and I got um, I got them all in the same scent and that is Mickey's oh boy because I I really like the scent of oh boy um, I haven't really, I haven't tried the totally mini on the coal sniff. I thought it, I thought it was okay, but I know that I like, oh boy. So, and I, I like it the strength wise in the wax. So I thought I'll probably like it in the scent circle. And I decided I wanted to pick up a couple of scent packs also in the licensed, but I didn't really want to do a six pack. So I just did a three pack of those, especially since I think I already have the Mickey Mouse and Friends. Um, I'm trying to think, there's not too many because most of the ones that came out in the collections were already sold out. So it's not like you had a large choice to pick from. So I didn't want to get a six pack. So I just got a three pack where I did two of the O Boys and one Totally Mini. I figured I'd at least give Totally Mini a try in the um, scent pack. And um, I think the Oh Boy especially will do really well in a buddy. So I figured I'd go ahead and pick that up. Then my other half price item that I got, I had I think three total that I could get. Um, the other One of the other ones that I got was a three pack of the fragrance flowers. And um, I think because I had just got around to putting a new flower in my uh, toilet room, you know, toilets have got its own like little room in the bathroom. Um, and I put in pink cotton. Oh, every time I walk into that toilet room, I'm like, gosh, it smells so good. And that's not usually something that you think when you go in a toilet room, but um, it does. It smells really, really good, that pink cotton. So I went ahead and, well, let's see, I picked up one in aloe water and cucumber. If you can see that, I don't know if you can see that, but that's what it says on the bottom, aloe water and cucumber. And which one is this? Oh, this one is, it's kind of abbreviated, but it's iridescent pearl got that one and then the third one should be yes it is okay and then the third one is a replacement of pink cotton so I am looking forward to being able to use that again probably in the same room because I love the way it smells and then there's just one well not one other thing in here but what I did um let's see I picked up a 25 watt green bulb and I picked up a three pack of the clear 25 watt bulbs and I got that to go with my last half price item which I did um, always try to do the bundle if you can especially if you're doing the half price item because wow you I mean you really can't beat that value I mean that that in itself is almost worth having a party just to be able to do that so i did um a bundle where you get the warmer and three bars of wax and then if you get that bundle it's already a little bit cheaper than buying them separately and then if you get it as a half price item like i said you can't beat that so anyways i got it uh the warmer in trust in him now i'm not gonna open this because I bought the bundle as a gift. Um, it is a gift for someone. And so I'm not going to open that one. So the three bars that I got to go with it were Amazon Rain, Aloe Water and Cucumber, and Mahalo Coconut. All scents that I love all three of them. I think they're wonderful. And... Um, the person that's getting this had told me that um, a lot of times they'll buy like the Better Homes and Gardens wax, which I didn't even know that they liked to do wax. Um, and 
they were talking about how sometimes they're, they're just too strong and they give them a headache and stuff. And so I tried to pick three bars that I thought were really good scents, but not ones that I think would give somebody a headache. So that's why I picked those three. I, I hope that they like them. And as part of the gift, I went ahead and got the three pack of um, light bulbs to give them with that warmer, that trust in him warmer. But what I did do, since I couldn't show you the warmer since it's not for me, I already own that warmer. And that warmer actually sits on my TV stand in my TV room, right? In the sunroom. So what I did was I took a picture of it so that I could show it to you, just so that you could see what it looks like lit up. It's absolutely beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Now I'm gonna show it to you. I have it sitting on a candle stand that I had bought from Bath and Body Works. I don't know, maybe a year and a half ago or so. Um, and I was just kind of playing around. I had it out there because I sometimes I have like a Bath and Body Works candle. And I think I had a candle on it at one time and I haven't, haven't burned any candles lately. So I just had the stand sitting there and I thought, I'm going to see if the warmer, if a warmer will fit on it. And I mean, it's like exact, I mean, perfect fit for it. Um, so I have it sitting on that. So when you see it, you'll know that, you know, it doesn't actually come with that height to it. It's actually sitting on a stand. So here is the warmer. Let's see. You can see it's on a stand there. But the detail on it is absolutely gorgeous. The cross, the words, the floral design that's cut into the warmer. It's absolutely gorgeous. And I thought this person that I'm giving it to would really enjoy it. Um, so I'm hoping that they like it. I think they will. But just wanted to point out... Um, I did really well for myself this month. Uh, those three bars were the only three bars in this entire two orders that I picked up. But those three bars are not mine. They are for someone else. And so I wanted to look at what I had purchased in bars for the month of April because I actually thought I was going to do more being that it was my birthday month, I wanted to treat myself and get some stuff that I wanted. And, and I did, I got some laundry liquids. I got some shower gels. I got some more flowers, but I really didn't go crazy on wax. I was determined not to buy a bunch of wax this month after doing my wax stash series and realizing how much wax I had. So I wrote it down. I picked up in the month of April, I picked up one Bloomin' Beach, one Kiss the Girl from the Little Mermaid collection, one Faithful Friends from Lady and the Tramp, um, and then when the Princess one came out, I did do a six pack. I did three of the True Love Awaits Disney Princess and three Oh Boy, because that time I wanted to do a six pack um, because I knew I wanted to get more than one of the Disney princess. And so I figured I'd just do a six pack and I bundled it with Oh Boy. Because I love that one so much. So not counting the three that I just picked up. Because they're not for me. And I'm not counting the scent of the month. Because as a consultant I just got that. So that's not something that I purposely went out and purchased basically. Um, so... I thought that was pretty good. I got six, seven, eight, nine, nine bars only that I purchased in the month of April when I really thought that I would have purchased a lot more. Um, I think that's pretty good. I think that's really, really good. And today is April 30th. So I'm going to upload this video and then tomorrow being Saturday, May 1st, I'm going to take some time and I'm going to do my empties video. And yeah, I went through a lot more than nine bars. So I definitely, you probably, probably the first time in a while, I probably, it was probably the first month where I used more wax than I brought in. So I'm very happy about that. I did purchase some wax, other wax in April, but it wasn't Scentsy. I wanted to um, delve into the vendor wax. So there was one 
company and I don't I don't know all of them. I don't know a lot about them. So I picked one that I had seen um uh, Ashley Nicole do a review on recently of this company of the Vendor Wax. So I thought, you know what? I'm going to uh I'm going to pick that one and I'm going to go on their site and they had some wax available. So I did make a purchase. Wasn't a huge purchase. It was um a little bit and so that's supposed to be coming in, I think, next week, I think. And so, but really, that's not that much. Um, I, I thought I did really well with not buying too much wax this month. I still wanted to try things. I still got some stuff. Um, but I'm, I'm happy with the fact that I didn't, I didn't replenish what I put, what I used. So I'm going to start working my way through what I have and I'm, Looking forward to that. And I'm looking forward to giving this person their gift. I hope they really enjoy it. I am happy to do that for somebody and the other gift also. So maybe not half, but some of what I purchased was not even for me. So um, anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope that you'll be back to see the empties video, which hopefully will be uploaded tomorrow. Um, based on when I'm recording this. And until next time, and enjoy your sense, enjoy your day, and enjoy your journey. Talk to you later. Bye.